Hello learners. In this tutorial, I am going to explain how to install Power BI Desktop on Windows 10 operating system. You can see in this link, uh, simply you can download, freely download that software. And uh, I will explain how to uh, in download and install uh, this software. Okay. First, uh, you have to uh, take your uh, favorite browser. In my case, I have used the uh, Google Chrome. So, simply you have to type uh, download uh, power bi desktop okay click on that and there is a first link you have to click on that link so uh, you can see uh, you can download all the power bi related softwares from this page you can see uh, there are power bi desktop power bi mobile on premise gateways and on-premise reporting, Power BI report server and publishers on all, all the components related to the Power BI you can download from this uh, site. So uh, under Power BI desktop menu, you can see there is an advanced download option. You can see, click on that, then it will uh, redirect to the new page, new tab and in that page you have a download link. In addition to that, you can see there is a detail. <coughs> Uh, in that uh, detail sections, you can see the uh, file types. There are 64 uh, bit versions and the 32 bit versions, and also published uh, date and versions also. So, as you uh, know, with the Power BI desktop monthly basis, they are uh, released new version. So, now we have the uh, 2021 May version. So, Likewise, in the June month also, they will publish another version. So, uh, those are the uh, new features also included with that. And after that, you can see the system requirement. Okay. And the system requirement, it will explain the supported operating systems. Like Windows 10, Windows 2012, R2 and likewise, it will uh, uh, explain all the operating systems in addition to that power bi desktop requires internet explorer 10 no greater version and also power bi desktop is available for 32 bit as well as for the 62 bit and also they have given the uh, installation instructions and simply you can download this one and you can install the msi so now uh, i am going to download this one so i am using the uh, i am going to download the english language setup so simply click on this download button and you can see uh, it will uh, uh, show the 64-bit uh, versions and the 32-bit version my operating system is this 64-bit uh, so i select this one and uh, it's about uh, 350 mb so click on the next button to download okay based on your uh, internet connection it will take some time so anyway once we download we will install this software okay so if you have any questions up to now you can put on the comment sections and uh, once download we will install that software Now you can see file has downloaded so I click on this one show in folders then it will open my uh, downloaded folder so uh, you can see this folder then you have to click on the uh, exe file okay so uh, once you click on this button uh, sorry exe file it will open the 
Yeah. Uh, welcome uh, to the Microsoft Power BI Desktop Setup Wizard. Then you have to select the English language. Then click on the next button. And uh, then uh, it will open another window. can see uh, then you have to uh, if you want you can read your privacy statements and other agreements so I'm not going to read this one so simply click on the next button then you have to accept your license agreement to install definitely uh, you must accept these agreements so once I check that checkbox you can click on the next button and uh, by default it will install into the program files if you want you can change that installation folder by click on this change button i'm not going to change this one so simply click on this next button and when you are installing now already you, you can uh, uh, already uh, you have uh, configure all the uh, instructions as with the installation and also while you are installing if you want to create a uh, desktop a shortcut in the desktop you can check that button so i'm check that button and uh, to install you can click on the install button and also based on your computer performance it will take some time so anyway after a few uh, minutes it will install Now you can see successfully we have installed the Power BI desktop version and if you want to launch the Power BI desktop click on this check that checkbox so I want to open this one so I check that one so click on the finish button so uh, automatically it will open the Power BI desktop okay so this is your uh, startup window so it will load in So this is the Power BI interface. Once you install, you can get that Power BI desktop versions. From that, you can uh, do a lot of uh, dashboards and visualizations. So there are different features available. In the next videos, I will explain how to develop the dashboards and reporting reports using Power BI desktop. So if you have any issues, any concerns related to this video, please uh, put on the comment section. Okay, thank you.